Okay, anyways. Hey guys! So, it's Raya, and it is not Wednesday. But anyways, so, what I'm doing today is I'm going to do this random 50 questions from Tumblr. So, okay, let's get started. Number one. <clears throat> what would you name your future daughter? I really like the name Sage, and... I like the name Lilith, but I don't think I would use that name. But yeah, those are the only two I could think of. Number two, <clears throat> do you miss anyone? I do. I actually, like, really miss my boyfriend. I know that's so cliche, but I haven't seen him in a couple days. Like, we still, we've still talked, but I haven't actually seen him, and it kind of makes me sad because I'm usually with him every day. Number three, what would you do if someone told you you were pretty? say thank you. I love when people compliment me and tell me I'm pretty. Like, I love being called pretty or cute. Like, this makes me feel good about myself. <clears throat> Number four, ever been told it's not you, it's me? The most cliche thing to say when breaking up with someone. But yes, someone has said that to me and I was just like, I guess. I was really upset at the time, but I was just like, really? That's what you're going to say right now. Okay. Okay, um, number five. What are you looking forward to in the next week? I'm actually looking forward to Monday because I'm actually going to go see, like, my family that lives in L.A. So I'm pretty excited for that. Um, number six. Did you go out or stay in last night? Um, I actually stayed in because I, I wasn't with my boyfriend. And usually if I'm with him, like, we'll go out and we'll go do something or we'll go hang out with friends. But I wasn't with him last night. So I actually, yeah, I stayed in. Um, number seven, how late did you stay up last night? I'm actually not even sure how late I stayed up. I don't know. Okay, number eight, honestly, has anyone seen you in your underwear in the past three months? Yes, <laughs> someone has. <laughs> um, number nine, what were you doing at 1230 this afternoon? I was actually in the shower. <laughs> Um, I just got out of the shower, and it is 12.53, so. Um, number 10. Have you ever told somebody you love them and not actually meant it? No, because why would you tell someone that? Okay, but I just went through something with this. So, like, this, some, one of my guy friends was, like, kind of getting, like, he felt like his girlfriend was being too clingy, and... She told him, like, I love you. And he said it back. And then he came and told me, like, I don't know why I said that. Like, I don't think I do. Don't say it if you don't mean it. Like, it's not that hard. Just be like, you know, I'm not ready to go that far. Like, I don't know. I don't know how you could say it without hurting them. Like, because they kind of just, like, told you everything. I don't know how you could say it without hurting their feelings. But if you don't mean it, don't say it. <laughs> okay. Number 11, could you go for the rest of your life without drinking alcohol? I think so. I think I can. Um, number 12, have you pretended to like someone? Uh, not in like the sense that like, like a crush kind of way. I've never pretended to like someone, but actually like as a friend, yes, because of the fact that my friends always hung out with that person. I didn't want to be mean to her. Like I didn't, <clears throat> I didn't like her. I, I still don't like her, but I kind of just dealt with her because of the fact that we have mutual friends. So yeah, I've done that. <laughs> um, could you, number 13, could you go the rest of your life without smoking a cigarette? Yes, I can. That is for sure. Yes, I can. Number 14, is there one person in your life that can always make you smile? Yes. Even when I am, like, really mad at him and I just want to punch him in the face, he always manages to make me smile. And that is my boyfriend. Number 15. Is it hard for you to get over someone? Um, it depends on why I have to get over them. If they, like, broke my heart, it'll probably take a minute to get over them. But if they, like, pushed me to the limit where I just had to, like, I had to leave... Probably not. It kind of depends on what you did to make me have to get over you. Um, number 16. Think back five months ago. Were you single? Yes, I was. Number 17. Have you ever cried from being so mad? Yes, I have. Number 18. 
hold have you held hands with anyone this week yes i have my boyfriend um number 19 did your last kiss take place in slash on a bed no my last kiss i took him home so i we were in the car i think or we had just gotten out of the car um number 20 how did you last who did you last see in person my mother number 21 what is the last thing you said out loud this question <laughs> number 22 have you kissed three or more people in one night no i have not um number 23 have you ever been to paris no i have not but i would really like to go i want to go there i hear it's beautiful number 24 are you good at hiding your feelings yes i am that is not a good thing but i am um number 25 do you use chapstick yes i do number 26 who did you last share a bed with my dog <laughs> number 27 are you listening to music right now no i'm not number 28 what is something you currently want right now i currently want to be with my boyfriend but i think he is out with his mom right now number 29 were you were your last three kisses from the same person? Yes, they were. Number 30. Who, how is your heart lately? My heart is great and in love. <laughs> um, number 31. Do you wear the hood on your hoodie? Hardly ever. I really don't. Like, unless it's like freezing and I need to wear it, I do not wear the hood on my hoodie. When was the last, oh, 32. When was the last time a num member of the opposite sex hugged you? I want to say it was Wednesday night because I haven't hugged any guys except for Nick lately. Number 33, what do people call you? Um, Mariah, Raya, Princess Raya, um, Barry, that's it really. Um, number 34, have you ever wanted to tell someone something but you didn't? Yes. Number 35, are there any stressful situations in your life right now? Um... There are some, but they're not, like, really big deals. Uh, number 36. What are you listening to right now? I'm not listening to anything. 37. What is wrong with you right now? Nothing. I'm actually, like, really good right now. <laughs> uh, 38. Love really is a beautiful thing, huh? Yes, it is. Um, 39. Do you make wishes at 11-11? Yes, I do. Um, 40. What is on your wrists right now? There's nothing on this one, and there's a rubber band on this one. Uh, 41. Are you single, taken, heartbroken, confused, or waiting for the unexpected? I am taken. Uh, 42. Where did you get the shirt slash sweatshirt you're wearing? Um, I stole this flannel <laughs> from my friend, and this shirt I got, my mom got it for me for senior portraits. But yeah, um... Have you ever regretted kissing someone? Yeah, I have. Um, my first, like, actual kiss, I really regret kissing that person. <laughs> I think I said that in one of my videos before, too. I actually do regret it. 44. Have you hugged someone within the last week? Yes, I have. 45. Have you ever kissed any... Have you kissed anyone in the last five days? Yes, I have. Um, 46. I think I... I don't know. Um... What were you doing at midnight last night? I don't know. I was either talking to Nick or I was sleeping. I'm not really sure. Um, 47. Do you miss the way things were six months ago? No, I do not. Uh, 48. Would you rather sleep with someone or alone with someone? 49. Have you ever been to Italy? No, but my dad just went there and he said it's like gorgeous and I would really like to go. Um, and then the last one is 50. Think of the last person who said I love you. Do you think they meant it? Yes, I think they did. <laughs> okay, so that was 50 random questions off Tumblr. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. Bye. Bye.